The saxophone, a woodwind instrument that's typically made of brass, is a prominent feature of jazz bands, marching bands, and horn sections. But the sax hasn't been around forever. So who invented the sax, and when did the instrument become so popular? Fittingly, a guy named Adolf Sax invented the saxophone in 1846. Born in 1814, Sax was a Belgian musician who grew up surrounded by instruments and musical inventions. He studied clarinet and flute at the Royal Conservatory of Brussels. In Paris, he patented improvements to the designs of existing instruments and created new instrument variations such as the sax horn and sax tuba. On June 28, 1846, Sax filed a patent for the saxophone, which was soon used widely in French military bands. He then taught and led the saxophone program at the Paris Conservatory and dealt with costly lawsuits filed by competing instrument makers over patent infringement. Due to these lawsuits, Sax actually went bankrupt three times before he died in 1894. But his childhood is what's really interesting. A series of childhood accidents befell young Adolf, but they didn't do lasting damage to the future inventor who was seemingly unbreakable. From the age of two or three years old, he fell down three flights of stairs, hit his head on a rock, swallowed a needle, and drank a bowl of sulfuric acid. So, parental supervision and child neglect laws were clearly different in those days. As if those accidents weren't enough, a young Adolf also received gunpowder burns, scalded his skin on a cast iron pan, almost died in his sleep from breathing in paint fumes, and nearly drowned in a river. This litany of mishaps and dangerous incidents was pretty crazy, and Adolf's mother even said of her son, He's a child condemned to misfortune. He won't live. But live he did, and Adolf went on to create the beloved saxophone.